as a result of financial crime issues, Namibia was greylisted by the Financial Action Task Force and placed under increased monitoring. A local commercial bank arranged the Anti-Financial Crime Conference, which brought together different stakeholders from regulators, lawmakers and role players in the financial sector. The aim of the conference is to create awareness with key players on what type of threats the financial industry faces and emerging risks that come with technology and artificial intelligence. The stability of our financial sector is not just a matter of compliance. It is a fundamental pillar of our economic development. A resilient and secure financial system is essential for fostering investor confidence, promoting sustainable growth, and safeguarding the interests of all stakeholders. Therefore, it is incumbent upon all of us to work together, share knowledge, collaborate effectively to mitigate the risk posed by financial crime. The threat of financial crime is ever evolving, particularly in a, this era of rapid digital transformation. As new technologies emerge, so do new opportunities for criminals. Financial crime can also negatively impact on the integrity of the country's financial credibility. The Deputy Governor of Bank of Namibia, Leonie Dunn, pointed out that financial crime affects and targets the most vulnerable in society. Therefore, it is important that stakeholders come together to find ways to prevent financial crimes. Namibia continuously stands on the precipice of significant change amidst a very positive shifting economic landscape for our country and insidious and all familiar threat continues to lurk in the shadows, namely financial crime. In its entire facet, inclusive of profit-generating criminal conduct, complemented by the laundering of the proceeds of such conduct, financial crime may significantly hamper the positive gains that we have thus far achieved by changing our economic landscape story. In a globalized and interconnected world, financial crimes continuously pose a serious threat, not only to stability and integrity of the financial system, but to the overall financial services industry. It remains a multi-trillion dollar epidemic that underpins many of society's most hideous crimes, inclusive of human trafficking, to drug trafficking, to wildlife trafficking, to ter terrorism, but to mention a few. Through this engagement, stakeholders further hope to find solutions on how to control and prevent financial crimes that can come with fast-changing technology.